Hello. Damn, I'm gonna die. No. Don't forget to subscribe and click that bell icon to get notified of my latest uploads. Hey guys, and welcome to episode 6 of my War of the Walkers mod series playthrough thing. <laughs> As you guys can see during that, I've been busy. I decided to break out all the windows, replace it with blocks, uh, clear out all the extra boxes and bags and stuff that was over here, and also I had a visitor during the night, but I'll get to that now. As you guys can see, I opened up the windows here. This will be my new entrance, and I closed off everything else, even the entrance we were using over here. So now it's only one way in and one way out. I think I put everything away that I needed to. As you guys can see, I'm making new tools. I reached level 30, so I was able to get my tool smithing up. Next is weapon smithing, and then just keep going from there. I actually need better, uh, better weapons, but I decided tools are more worth it. Okay, I also made some forged iron so I can repair all these, and I noticed I already read the pistol book, so I was able to take all the ammo out. Speaking of ammo, let's just dump all of it over here. And the... The surprise that I was talking about, guys, the bandit, there was actually a bandit outside, and he dropped a sniper rifle. It's a crappy one, but it's better than any gun we have thus far, so I'm taking it. And then I'm going to sell all these guns and clothes, and hopefully we get a... I thought I had something outside. Hopefully we get a wrench. Damn. <laughs> okay, uh, this is down here. So we're just going to put these ladders in, and then we'll put the coffee over here. I actually drank two coffees to break all of these out, and they last quite long. The boost is almost indefinite. Firstly, we're going to have to get rid of the snake, so it's going to get us as soon as we get down there. Okay, so now... Stand still, dammit. Whoa, it's fast. It's very fast. Perhaps the trader has a... Why am I missing this? Engine and a battery or something. It's not standing still long enough for me to really hit it. This is bullshit. Thank you. Whoa. <laughs> okay, now that was one seriously strong snake. Whoops. No, 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 no. Please don't break anything now. He actually broke through two layers of block over here. There's another snake over here somewhere. You need to be careful. Okay, so... Unfortunately, I do not have my stone axe to repair that right now, but at least it's on the inside. Wait, you can't place on that. That's messed up. Okay. Whoa. Hello, jump up. So after a while, I'm going to put a drawbridge over here. And then that's going to be our entrance. But for now, this will have to do. It's actually a shame that I have this ladder over now. I should drop it, but I'm just going to put it there for now. So all of this I want to sell. And please tell me they actually have a wrench at the trader. So now, which way to go? This way over here. I'm actually glad it's not... Wait, the... Where's the shops? I can't remember where the uh, shops were we were last episode. I think it's this direction, and that's where we actually had the problem with the bandit, the one with the gun. So we just need to be very careful. Okay, so now we can put our mining armor on. Out of danger via. So with the coffee, we should be able to outrun any feral, any zombie, but the dogs, I doubt. That's the big problem. Just please tell me you're not going to get another bandit. I seriously thought bandits were only in Darkest Falls. Because, I mean, I didn't get any bandits while playing this mod thus far. And then all of a sudden, bandits. It was not a nice surprise. Also, guys, uh, like I said last episode, these videos are going to be a little bit shorter. Um, but I'll be able to upload more. So what I'm going to try and do, but I won't always get uh, right is on Saturdays we record War of the Walkers and then Sundays we record The Darkest Falls for that week. So I'm going to pre-record three episodes at a time and then sometimes if I don't get a chance then it's only going to be like one or two episodes and then during the week the rest. Damn, this bit of stutter. Thought I was a dog. Just a deer. But speaking of, we need meat. Please tell me I can hit it from here. Bullseye. And I think we also have a knife over here. Yes, we do, so we can get a nice amount of meat. This trader was actually a lot closer than I thought. Is this all the... Yeah, it's very close. Damn. Okay, so watch out for any bandits in the area, because I know they love hanging around these traders. 
Also watch out for the lumberjacks, dogs, and landmines. See, that's what makes this biome so, so much fun and so challenging to live in. Just notice it's 6.15, that's only when they open. I th really thought it, oh, what? That's messed up. Hey, jackass. Can okay, I so let's sell. No. For you? Please don't tell me this one's bugged. Well, how about you browse your ass right out of my store? Oh, no, that's really messed up. I can't sell to the trader. And that's all you buy? No refunds. Let's see if I can do this faster. Deal's so, done. enter, now sell, beat sell. It, fucker. Oh. oh, I can actually go in here and sell. While wow, those references are spawning like that. So, sell everything we can in here, and then just get... The oh, damn. Sold my shotgun slugs. I just realized the shotgun shells were ejected from the guns as I sold them. Now, I, I'm just really bothered by these null reference exceptions. We also need to find a horde base this episode. <laughs> That's it for what we want to sell. Glory now the problem is, I want to see what he has. Now but as soon as I want to talk bucker. to him, I get this null reference. Okay, repair kits, gloves, I can't read what, iron chest, armor schematic, shotguns, nope, tools, please tell me, damn, he doesn't have any wrenches over here, we need those wrenches, there's actually a gap over here, I think that's what's causing the null reference, uh, we need shotgun ammo, how much do you have, only one, it's the one we sold him, this is really messed up. Okay, so now it's All time right, to go now to that we're the done doing business, get ship out of my store. Damn, I can't believe the bad luck we're having in this trade now. Come on, come on, come on. Hopefully, I'm not going to keep getting that as I go to the ship. Okay, so I think I'm going to cut most of what just happened out. So I'm going to explain now. Um, the trader was bugged, it kept giving null reference, a dog almost killed me so I had to god mode away from there. So, I can't use that trader again, I have to go to the ship and see if I can find something cool over there. I just hope I don't get the same errors over there, that's gonna really ruin my day. Just drop all the food over here, drink the water. Ooh, I wanted to sell the animal hides. I think I'm gonna keep the tokens on me, I mean if my backpack gets destroyed that's gonna be a major loss. But if we come across a trader, no, no, I'm not going to take the chance. There's no way I'm losing that many coin. So let's just do this and this. Okay, so now we have shotgun shells again. Let's just drop this one. Grab the shotgun and that should be it for now. Okay, so on to the ship we go. I actually feel like doing the horde on the ship. So I want to clear out that place before let's just see where the ship is yeah, i want to clear that out before the horde so we can actually use that during the horde it's a real shame that i wasted my coffee with the excursion unfortunately i couldn't use the other coffee bean because i want to plant that and get more coffee so let's just hope we get to that ship and loot it before the end of this episode So I just heard an SMG over there. I wonder if that's a survival or if that's a bandit. And it doesn't sound like it's getting closer, but it could be. I want to see if that was an auger. Come on, so many survivors in the area. I want to see if that was an auger blade or if that was a chainsaw blade. I should really actually kill that pig over there. Next skill I have to up also is my blunt weapon skill, my pummel peat. Damn, there are actually quite a few survivors out here, NPCs out here. I really thought that, oh there's one over there, yeah that's another NPC. I just have to keep my eyes open for bandits guys because the bandits will attack me. Bandits are usually the ones with heavy armor on. Ooh, there's iron on top of here. Damn, if I had the tools, I'd actually, I'd have actually chopped all of this up. I need the iron. 
But unfortunately, we're going to have to get to that ship before nightfall. And it is day seven, so if we don't get there before nightfall, we're screwed. And the poor survivor is being attacked by a wolf. But I don't want to get too close because sometimes they can shoot you by accident. Wait, which way am I running now? Where's the ship? I know the ship is in the area, but where? Oh, there. That ship is massive, so if we do not manage to loot the whole thing this episode, then what I'm going to do is stack frames off the side of it so the zombies, the horde, stay underneath the frames. If we manage to loot this whole thing this episode, then I'll definitely face the zombies more head on. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Hello. Damn, I'm gonna die! No, 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 no! Please attack the zombie, please attack the zombie. Unfortunately, I didn't have enough frames on me, which is a new mistake, which I usually have on me. Run, 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 run. Please forget about me. Damn, I should have had frames on me. I usually have. I'm just glad I do not have... Damn, I'm still being attacked. Please tell me it's not by the wolf. I usually have frames on me and bandages. I'm just glad that I'm not bleeding. I need to get away from these zombies. Get a few frames. And then start killing some zombies. Okay, so we're safe for now. Let's quickly make those frames. Like so. Okay, now, so if the wolf still comes for us, we'll be able to kill it. There's a pig somewhere over here. I should have really brought that coffee. If not for the run, then at least for the melee on the ship. I just hope that I'm able to kill everything that's following me right now. And that nothing surprises me from the back. Oops, almost. It's gonna suck if the wolf followed me in this direction, lost me, and then takes me from uh, from behind now. Okay, so I have no idea how many feathers I got in that bird's nest, but I hope it's enough to make some serious ammo. Because I just ran out. Damn, only six. Okay, so we're gonna do this melee. Let's just hope we do not get bombarded by zombies. Is there a way into this thing though? So I think for now we'll stick to a little bit of melee. And just reserve our ammo or arrows for really tough zombies. The bummer is that I run out of stamina fast. I got the stamina perk, the sexual Tyrannosaurus. But I wonder if that's going to be enough. Ooh. Hunting rifle, should I actually keep that on me? Let's see if there's a way on. If not, then I'm going to have to break through. Or rather, no, 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 no. I'm going to stack up. If I break through, then the zombies might reach us. So what we also can do now is just this. And then this way, the zombies can't reach us during the night. Uh, so let's hope this isn't as big as it seems. Because if it's not, we'll be able to clear this place out in no time. See if I can kill all of these. Bullseye. Bullseye. So someone over there saw me. And can I get his head? Oh damn, that was a bad shot. I really thought I was gonna be able to get him. Okay, so we're gonna get these two from below. Three from below. Okay. Where are you guys going? Come on, follow me. It's messed up that they go to the position they first sense you at and then come after you. Hello, yes, it's me. Hello, is it me you're looking for? I can see it in your zombie eyes. Okay, so let's see if there are any zombies left in here. Be careful, John, be careful. Ooh, quite a bit of loot in here though. I think the looting we might just do off camera because I need to clear this place out before dark. Please tell me I got everyone. 
Damn, there's quite a few layers in this place, isn't there? No zombies. Let's see if there's a zombie up there. We need to uh, cover every nook and uh, cranny of this place to really call it clear. Ooh, hello. Otherwise, if there's just one zombie left, that one can surprise us during the night. I should also make some frames now so I can start preparing that thing I was talking about earlier. I just need a ledge over here and they won't attack the ship, they'll only try it and attack me. Okay, so no zombies over here. This is the captain's quarters, which means there's quite a bit of loot in the bookshelves over here. Okay, so no zombies, lucky us. No zombies. At least this way, even though we're not looting, we are covering the whole place. We're getting a feel for how big the ship is and what the rooms are. I think even if the timer was to go off now, I'll still finish the ship. So I need to finish the ship before I can continue. I just hope there are no dogs or anything in here because that's going to suck. That is really going to put a damper on things. Okay, so this is a massive loot room. Guys, next episode is going to be awesome. I think off camera I'm going to open up all these boxes and then... Yeah, we're going to do some awesome looting. So we could go... No, we can't go down there. We have to go down here. This is a working... Should we make this our base? I mean, I didn't want to since Darty Pants already did this in one of his streams. But I mean, this could be an awesome base if you protected it well enough. So guys, let me know down below. Would you like to see me turn this into a base? Oh, come on. Please tell me there are no other zombies in there. Come on. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, phew. So let's just go out here. I hope that one doesn't see us. Because I couldn't see his head, so I couldn't kill him. Please tell me, is he still there? Yeah. Hello. Okay, so at least we can see his head. Kill him. Please, no zombie surprises in here. Uh-oh. Should actually close this door because there's a zombie outside. Okay, so that seems to be either downstairs. It can't be upstairs. Wait, what the hell was that? What the hell was that? They actually disappeared just now. See, the spawn points are already moving around so i'm gonna have a very bad time cleaning everything up the only problem with using this as a base is it's so massive it's easy not to or it's easy to get lost and also easy not to use everything and this is a lot of loot this is a ton of loot okay, let's see if there are any zombies in here no zom zoms Guys, if it wasn't Horde Night, I'd actually loot as I was going on. But unfortunately, I can't afford that right now. Because, I mean, <laughs> Horde Night is so close by, or close at hand. And I don't want them wrecking into the ship. Because if you're in the ship, they're going to come for you. Sounds like there's a Horde outside. Ooh, more loot. Oh, is that zombie upstairs? Yeah, it's upstairs. Damn. Okay, so this is the bottom, it seems. There's no zombies in there. No zombies in there. So, if I'm not mistaken, we're at the very bottom now. Yeah. Whoa, hello. These are the ones I saw despawn. Okay, so where did this guy go? Because I need to kill him now. Did he just go downstairs again? Ah, oh, he did. Hello. So just one more. Where are you? I'm actually stuck over here now. So that could have ended very badly. Let's open this door, stand up. Uh oh, I'm stuck. I am stuck. Now how am I supposed to move from here? Can I destroy this? 
Okay, so almost. Thank you. And that seems to be it for the zombies. Let's just quickly prepare for the horde. I'm going to put those frames out and then we can actually start looting now. Because I cleared out most of this place, so at least we're safe from the zombies on the inside. Now, just to prevent any zombies from digging into the sides of here. So where are those ladders? Where did I get up? Okay, so this is where I got up. Um, I don't want to be too high up because then the zombies won't recognize me properly. So what we could do is just put the frames of yeah. This is hope there are no cops during the night. And like so. So I'm going to use this as a ledge. And they shouldn't attack the ship because the ship is slanted in that way. So they should all just walk underneath me. That way at least we can protect the ship, and then perhaps use this as a base. Guys, remember, I said I want to use the wasteland as a base, but you see how much trouble we're having there with, with the NPCs and the dogs and stuff, so let me know down below. Would you guys like to see me do a base over there in that square building, or actually use the ship? I'm more inclined for the ship. It's, I've never used the ship before, because I mean, it's only, it's only in this mod, so it might be worth trying. And I'm getting cold for the first time in this game. So there's no loot up here. We had that one chest. This could actually be a really cool build. I just need to see where all the rooms are especially so I can decide which room is what room. Like forge room, building room, sleeping room. This will obviously be the bedroom. Since it is the captain's quarters. I think it'll also be some fun, real fun. Ooh, hello. Don't have any tools to break that open. I think it will be real fun trying to protect this. And then also putting in traps for this place. Damn. Uh, I think I'm just going to call it an episode here, guys. I'm going to make a chest on the deck. Oh, please tell me that was... Oh, that was under the recipe. No, but... What? Learn how to craft a wrench. So I can already craft one. Then why haven't I done so yet? Damn. Okay, anyways. Um... I'm going to make the chest on the deck, and then I'm going to dump all of this there, and I'm going to see if I can start the next episode from there, so we can do some looting and then face the horde. Because, I mean, the horde isn't that long, and we need to get some looting done as well, because this place is massive. You saw all those chests. Oh, no, 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 no. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go through the ship, break open all the containers, not loot them yet, and then next episode we face the horde, and then we do some looting together. I think that's going to be the best course of action. Just want to make sure that I have all these rooms in here. Okay, so if you guys liked this episode, please have a like and share with your friends. Any comments or tips or feedback for me? Do you know why the trader bugged out? All of that, leave that down below. Also, guys, should I use this as a base? It's, it's big, but I mean, it's going to be awesome. It's going to be really, really awesome. So let me know that, that down below. And if you guys are new to this channel, please remember to hit that subscribe button for more of this content. See you guys next time.